In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a belter of a recipe using Scotland's favourite drink. Nope, not with whiskey. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a belter of a recipe in the slow cooker using Scotland's favourite drink. Nope, not with super tea either. Today friends, we are cooking iron brew chicken in the slow cooker. Hi, I'm nutritionist Scott Batty and in this episode from the High Protein Kitchen, we are going to make a delicious recipe for slow cooker iron brew chicken. No, this is not an April Fool's. It's a legit recipe that I came up with and it actually tastes really, really good. It's kind of like a sweet and sour chicken, but just a bit more interesting, and it's got that added banter factor to it as well. Now, for those unfortunate souls who can't get their mitts on a can of the good stuff, you can replicate this recipe using a can of some other kind of fizzy juice instead. Right, hold on your sporin, let's get cooking. The first thing you want to do is to just peel and chop an onion. It can be red or white, just whatever you've got lying around in the cupboard, and this is going to help form the sauce. You then want to heat a frying pan on a medium heat, add a few squishes of cooking spray and add the onion to the pan and just fry it for a few minutes until the onion starts to turn golden. Once your onion is cooked, you want to add one garlic clove and then fry that for a further 30 seconds. At this point in the video, it would be great if you could hit that like button. It just means you're more likely to see more of my videos in the future. Once your onion and garlic is fried, add it to the slow cooker along with your chopped chicken breast. I'm using about a kilo. Yes, you could use thighs, but again, it would change the calories. And then add a teaspoon of smoked paprika along with 30 grams of corn flour to help thicken it. A half teaspoon of salt, 20 ml of Worcester sauce, and about 20 grams of tomato puree. Get the black pepper mill out and add a good few grinds and then mix everything through before we add the magical, most important and key ingredient of the whole dish. Once everything is mixed through, add your iron brew to the mixture and then give it a further mix. Once you've mixed everything through, just pop the lid on it and then cook on low for about four to five hours. When it's ready, take the lid off and breathe in that iron brewy goodness. Not sure if that's a real word, but let's pretend it is. And then just start to plate it up. Now, like I said before, this recipe is similar to a sweet and sour, so it would work really well with rice as an accompaniment. Or if you were keeping the carbs down, you could just add lots of vegetables to it. Garnish with something green. I'm using parsley just to give it a bit more color, but that is it. So there we go, iron brew chicken cooked in the slow cooker. Not sure if we would call this traditional Scottish scran, but it smells pretty good anyway, and I'm pretty sure you'll enjoy it. So if you did like this video, please click that like button before you go, because it just means you're more likely to see these videos in the future. And if you're a new viewer, click subscribe so you don't miss out on future recipe videos as well. Thanks again for watching. I'm off to go and scoff this. I'll speak to you soon.